Boxing King Media. Callum Smith, how proud are you of uh, your young, younger brother, older brother? Older brother, I don't know, not that old. But yeah, no, unbelievable. I always have been, always will be. Um, it's good to witness nights like this as a family. And it's good to win as the underdog. He was the underdog tonight. And it's always that little bit sweeter. Not many people give him a chance, probably outside of our team and our family. But we always knew what he was capable of. And now he's, he's going to reap the rewards. Great night. Great night for the city. Great night for the family. Let's enjoy it. Did you ever expect it to end like that, you know, honestly speaking? No, let's say I'd be lying if I said that. No, I knew that was going to happen. I, I was always confident he'd win. I mean, life was on the line. I'd have probably said points. I, I've said in previous interviews, you've got to give you bank credit where it's due. He's shown good durability throughout his career. He's always inherited his dad's chin. He took some big shots of George Groves up a super middleweight. And his chin's always, you no. Know, held up but in the same sense as Liam was saying what don't be surprised with any outcome a good chin's a good chin but the right shot the right time can hurt anyone and I think that was the case tonight he landed a really really good shot got a reaction and went for the finish and got it but whether it was points not how win the win was you know, something we were always very confident in to get it the way he did just that makes it that little bit more special where do you think that ranks for him is that bigger than the WBO title when he won that um <laughs> I don't know, you'll have to Dad ask Dad says it is. Yeah, you'll have to ask him personally. I think as a kid, you don't dream about being in, no, big fights with big money, you dream about becoming a world champion. So I think when he won that belt, that ticked that box from, you know, an eight, nine-year-old version of himself. But to win in fights like these are probably what you get remembered for. These are the fights people remember him for. And he's never shied away from it. He's been in some big names already. And, no, he'll, he'll carry on doing it till he's done. He's he's a, he's a great throwback fighter. He fights anyone. He's always in good fights, always in exciting fights. And, well, tonight was just another one to add to it. No, very, very good career he's had. Did it mean more because of what happened at the press conference and all the hype you kind of brought in the last couple of days? Um, again, you'll have to ask Liam how personally took it all. Obviously, as a brother, yeah. just watching on. Yeah, just the, obviously the big fights, big builds up, always makes that win that little bit sweeter. And to win as an underdog makes it that little bit sweeter as well. With the bookies, he was the underdog with a lot of no boxing pundits and stuff. He was the underdog, so. Moving up in weight, not many people felt he was capable of doing it. Eubanks obviously boxed at 168 and comes down to 160. Liam's moving up from 154. But again, as a family, we were you know, confident in Liam's abilities and knew that 160 would probably shoot him, and it did. It's a good fight for four rounds, but you know, Liam got the job done, and it's, it's, a, it's a night that you know, one of our better nights as a family and one we're going to enjoy. Rematch, or do you want him to go, go a different route, world title route? Uh, either, I think if Eubank wants the rematch, I think Liam's probably contracted to it, I'm not sure. I think he'll gladly take it. He's beaten once, he'll beat him again probably for more money this time. But either way, if no the rematch clause isn't isn't taken up, then he's done himself no harm. He's in a very, very good position. He had really good rank rankings at 154 anyway. He probably have similar rankings at 160 now. So the future's bright definitely if he wants to go and pursue another world title, which was the goal until this fight was offered. He can do that if he have to have a rematch, I'm sure he'll jump at the chance to do it again. Cal, congratulations to, to you and your family. Thank you very much, mate. Thank you.